just to serve this 52 aircraft. I'm from here. You're a Sorry. <laughs> well, I'd love to get you in that one, sir, but um, <laughs> Oh dear. Are you not doing the flying jacket? <laughs> well, we could always do the um, the, 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 the bit, it's a bit yeah. tight actually. So. Oh, is it? Oh, look, it's a cop out. As <laughs> it stand on the seat, and if you put your two hands on the seat, just squeeze it up gently. And you're in. <laughs> Just come around there. It's not easy, you know, trying to work one of these things and walk around. Yeah. <laughs> Cheers. <laughs> On. You don't have much movement because you're hitting the stops on the tail. Oh, sorry, right. That's no problem. Um, stop that mixture on the air on the engine. This controls two feet or bumps on the front leading edge of the wing. It's got a leading edge slats. That will put them out of the wing as they roll flat. It's like a flat. It's a leading edge slat, so what it does, it controls the airflow over the front of the wing. But it's effectively the flaps go on the back, the slats go on the front. But is it the same, the same idea? It's basically the same idea. It increases the width of the air. Then down, actually if you pull that back as it falls a bit, yeah. you can feel the strength here. Yeah? So there's a little yeah. down here. So if I yeah. now pull that back, now pull it back forward. Is it any different in weight? Yeah, yeah. So with yeah. this aircraft, on a lot of aircraft you have what they call a trim tap. Mm -hmm. Which is a very small tap that you just use to adjust. Yeah. On this aircraft we don't have it, and we control the sort of sensitivity of the system by adjusting that the so it controls the control. Okay, instruments. That's where we go. If you can see it's dust because we don't use it as the printers, but most people fly with them visual Um that's the engine up here. And we like to do that between 2000 and 2004 because power, power profiles and also because it's inverted engine keeps it all very nicely. Oil pressure, if that gets too low, you land straight away. Because if the engine loses oil pressure, it's going to see it's going to be a lot more to shorten your, your air show. Um, so sometimes if you're in cloud you might not know which way it goes, so yeah. that will turn left to right. And it will also tell you how much your side stick. Because aircraft don't necessarily have to always fly straight away with a twist. And if you think about it, the prop is spinning and you've got wind coming up over there, but wind going down over there, so you do get a little bit of torsion. And if you've seen any films on TV of things like Dakota's taking up, you go, and they all seem to fly out of that. That will indicate there. And when you're actually turning, you want to put your feet back from in zero. Because if you're turning, it's got your own last sweep. Well, you could be not doing it off or you could be too flat. Um, airspeed. Sorry, airspeed and air, um, speed across the land. And that's the, I call this the farmer digit. You don't die. Because if it's below zero, you generally plow. Okay. So you're quite, you're quite a long way down. But, um, that's it, and interesting enough, head in centre, very, very little draft. Move your head at all left and right, and your nostrils seem to extend right up around the top of your head. Because, yeah. But very, very light on controls, very, very light in the air, very, very light on the um, Fully, fully aerobatic, and um, it's a fine one. Everything that we can we fly. If the hangers from the ceilings, they don't fly, but everything in this room would have been flying today. This one, this we do what we call barnstorming with it. So I will hold the two six meter poles with the ribbon between and they will fly. 